What's going on guys? Today we're gonna to learn Where's My Mind by the Pixies. I'm gonna show you the chords and strumming and the riff, which I'm sure you recognize if you're on this video. Make sure to check out my free 10 Steps to Mastering the Guitar training in the description below this video. Let's get into it. All right, so this one's gonna be a really easy tutorial. I'm gonna teach you the strumming pattern, and then I'm also gonna teach you the little riff part there that's played through most of the song. So starting off with our strumming, and then you can do this pattern for the entire song if you're just on you on acoustic guitar. Our chords are gonna be E, C sharp minor, moving down, keeping the exact same shape to G sharp, and then sliding one fret over with that same six string bar chord shape to an A. These are gonna be our same four chords for the entire song and our strumming is gonna be down, 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 up. So you're gonna do that on the first three chords. Right there, and once you've got that, switch over to that A, and we're just gonna go down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Add that to the full thing. And there's your entire strumming pattern. And if you want, you can play that for the entire song. No need to overcomplicate things if you don't have to. All right, so there's the chords, that's it. Okay, so that's all there is to it for the strumming. If you want, you can play this lead part on your acoustic if you wanna learn that, but you can also play it on electric, which obviously is how it's played in the actual song. So, now we're going to play this. So this one shouldn't take you too long to get, it's pretty simple, and if you just throw your guitar onto some heavy distorted crunch setting or something, then you should be able to get a pretty decent tone. Alright, so we're going to start here, 5th fret, 2nd finger of the 2nd string. Alternate between that and the 1st finger on the 4th fret of the 1st string. And you're just going to alternate 4 times. And then, you're going to switch down to that 4th fret of the 2nd string. I prefer to do it with a bar here, but you can do it however you want, either bar or both these fingers on the same fret. So we've got and then you do a slide from this fifth fret of the second string. And add that onto the end. So all together. And that's the entire riff. You can play that through all the parts in the song where it's played, it should be pretty obvious. Or you can just strum it for the entire song on your acoustic guitar. Whatever works for you, go for it with what you have and what you like. And with that, you can play the entire song. If you are playing this on an electric guitar and you want to play the corded part, then you can just do the exact same chords as I was playing for the strumming version, but just play them as power chords instead. So that would be an E power chord then up to the C sharp, then down to the 4th fret of the 6th string, for the G sharp, and then end on the A. And you can do the exact same strumming. And that right there is the entire song. You can just do that instead of your full bar chords if you want to play this on the electric. 
There you go. If you can play those parts, you can play the entire song. Please hit that thumbs up button and say hi in the comments below. Also make sure to subscribe and hit those notification icons so you never miss one of my uploads and you learn guitar a lot faster.